Hello everybody. Look what I did. I came to Costco. Never been here before. Check this out. It's so quiet. Okay. Seems like Costco has a lot more furniture than Sam's Club. It's not too bad looking. Hey, that looks like leather. Wow, Where's the Right. Oh, they have appliances. I think Sam's Clubs, you can get appliance online. I don't think they have them in the store. We can go down there and look. Okay, I just saw these hangers at Sam's Club because my sister bought like 500 boxes of these to change out her cupboard. I'm gonna have to compare that price. I'm not real sure what that is. So, there's computers behind me. And oh, look at these appliances. Oh, I like this. Oh. oh my goodness. I think I'm going to buy a membership just to get that. Or maybe not. Oh my goodness. Look at this. So watch this. Knock twice and see inside the fridge. have to look because I bet you you can get these from um, Sam's Club just online but then again maybe not but I mean Costco membership just for appliances I probably wouldn't do so let's go check out the things that I normally buy well I like this metal basket that's only $15 that's really nice and oh my gosh it's kind of heavy wonder where that's made. Oh, there we go. Made in China. The clothes here go on endlessly. Much more than you know where. Now we're getting into tables and chairs. Oh, they got a, oh is that nice? What's that? This works out great because I was just at Sam's Club and I went over their entire seafood display. So here we have wow, wow, wild sockeye salmon for 10 bucks a pound. Ooh, fresh ahi tuna, $15 a pound. Farmed Atlantic salmon, $8.50. Always go with the wild. Oh, what is that? Oh, wild Atlantic cod, $8.50 a pound. I don't know what I just paid for mine. Mahi Mahi tuna fillets. That's nine a pound. Atlantic salmon farmed, ten a pound. Oh, and then they have instant rebate, three dollars off per package will be taken at the register. So that's probably about a dollar fifty off a pound. Haddock, I like haddock. Nine dollars. They're not letting us um, buy anything. We're allowed to look around. We're not allowed to shop. Stuffed salmon. Um, Nine dollars a pound. That looks really good. Flounder. Nine. Oh my. Don't need anything with eyes. Sea bass. Eight a pound. Tilapia. Don't like that too much. Five a pound. Mmm. Farmed steelhead. Eight a pound. Clams. I don't even care. Don't like them. Oh, look at the tiny lobster baby tails. Twenty-six a pound. Stay there. My sister's in the store. We got some farmed shrimp. Eleven a pound. Oh, crab legs. I just can't do them. I'd eat. I'd eat this whole thing. Twenty-five a pound. And what do we have here? Langostino. Oh, I can't see the price. What the heck? Thirteen fifty a pound. What is it? So we have. I know. Yeah, got that. They got baby crab legs too. I mean, lobster tails. She's over there, like, yeah. So this is um, boneless pork shoulder, dollar ninety nine a pound. $4.50 off a package. Well, it's not 
much of a savings, but it's better than nothing. Um, actually, locally, every January, a local store, our Shop and Save, has uh, pork butt for 99 cents a pound. We usually always... Oh, this is shredded Parmesan and Romano. We get this shaved at Sam's Club, so I can't even compare that. That's two pounds for ten fifty. We've got the Pecorino Romano, pound and a half, ten dollars. That's a shredded cheese. Wait a second. Ooh, cheese maybe. Wraps. Well, then why wouldn't you just use a piece of cheese? Shredded Parmesan Romano, one pound is. 14. So we have two pounds of uh, fresh mozzarella for $8.39. That says sliced. Maybe this isn't what we're they're talking about, but it's right there in front of that. Okay, we've got pepper jack cheese, $7 for two pounds. We like our pepper jack. We have this exact thing pretty much. Okay. Well, it might be a different brand at Sam's Club. This is two pounds, $9.99, the variety pack of cheeses. So I don't know what I paid, but I just bought something extremely similar to this. This is Sparella Mini's uh, Prosecuto Suppressida and Prosecuto. Oh, same thing again. Um, and that is... 1.2 pounds for $15. Okay. So we have here six cans of Kirkland chicken breast, 12 and a half ounces, uh, $9.99 on special for $7.99. Okay. So here's some broccoli cheddar soup. Is that two quarts? Four pounds. Well, they're just saying four, four pound, two two pound tubs. That's probably 30, 32 ounces maybe. And that is $7.99. That's real comparable. I could definitely have some king crab chowder, but I just have this aversion to putting corn in my soup. I just can't do it. This is 40 ounces total. Two pounds, eight ounces for nine fifty-nine. So then, this is definitely something that not this brand, but we get the creamy, you know, tomato basil organic soup at Sam's Club. Okay, sixty ounces, two thirty-ounce tubs, nine ninety-nine. Not sure if that's. I'm gonna really have to check because the prices seem similar, but yet not. And be still my heart. Oh my gosh. Be still my heart. Lobster bisque. Freezable two pack. I wouldn't even freeze it. I'd just drink it. Two pounds, eight ounces. Nine thirty-nine. At least they break it down per pound. Three seventy-five a pound. And we definitely get some lobster bisque at uh, SC. And they've got this Deer Park sparkling water. I would be interested in some of that. That's $8.79 for a 24 pack of bottles. Alrighty, so we've got the Deer Park water here. 48 bottles that are eight ounce bottles. Sure, what time do they close? 6.39. This is the one we get, 40 eight ounce bottles for $5.49. Pretty sure that's what we pay to. This looks interesting. Nestle Splash, 32 bottles, and berry, orange, acai, grape, and lemon. I think this actually has less flavor in it though, and that's only $6.99. That's not a bad price at all. $6.99 for 32 ounces of Nestle Splash. But I don't think that's carbonated either, is it? Here's another price I can definitely compare because I bought these on sale not too long ago. 18 packs, 3 pounds of, um, well 3 pounds, what, 13 ounces of Ritz crackers. These are $8.89. I think Sam's Clubs, they were $8.99, so real similar. Only I got them on a special, which I'm sure they go on special here occasionally as well.
So I always love my Starbucks. Looks like here I can only find the French roast, which is fine, I guess, but it's not my Pike Place. So I'm probably, I bet you they have it, and it's the same price here, $17.99. Only it's gonna go on sale shortly at Sam's Club for four dollars off, with a limit of five. And then of course Folgers Classic. That's a 51 ounce container for $8.99, $2.81 a pound. I don't think that's too bad either. Some Manuka honey. And that's a big jar. 1.1 um, pound. MGA 263 10 plus UMF. <laughs> and that is $31.99. You know what, I can't even say if that's a good or a bad price. I don't think we have that where I normally shop. And then I like my spices too. Prime rib seasoning for beef and pork. And that thing is $7.99. Does it have salt in it? I don't like, oh, yep, salt's the number one ingredient. We don't want that. Here we have regular wildfire flower honey, $10 for five pounds. Wow, that's really cheap. Here we've got $10.99 for honey bear. Oh, three one pound, eight ounce honeys. Or is that the whole thing? No, pretty sure that's oh, agave. $8.99. Let's see if they have some erythritol. Well, it's not with the Splenda or the Truvia. Might be in the baking aisle. We've got organic sugar, granulated sugar, powdered sugar, turbinado sugar. Okay, here's a huge bag of sugar. Not that I want that, but 50 pounds, $22.69. Well, remember I just got four pounds of sugar on sale for 99 cents, 25 cents a pound. And so this is almost twice what I paid, but don't forget, I didn't get that at Sam's Club either. That was a John Eagle on sale special. And they don't have those very often. That was my stock up. Okay, here's some Himalayan sink, pink salt, sink salt, sink salt. That is 6.69 and it's a for five pounds, that's a dollar thirty-three a pound. This salt is a—it's not Kirkland brand, but it's Himalayan pink salt. It's a dollar a pound at uh, Dollar Tree, and a five-pound bag is four dollars at Big Lots. So I'm not sure how much it is at Sam's Club. I don't even check it there. But guys, we're just about done. We're about ready to hit the road. Uh, here's peppercorns, five twenty a pound. I don't think that's a bad price. I prefer the mixed peppercorns though. But anyway, oh, here's what some people say is really good. Three pounds of Kirkland's almond flour, $13.39. I think I paid a little less than that at Walmart. That's so frustrating when you pay a membership fee and things are cheaper at Walmart or Big Lots or Dollar Tree. Um, we just paid $3.99 for two pounds of garlic, I think it was. Might have been three. No, three ninety nine is what we paid at Sam's Club the other day. I'm not sure of the weight though. Um, you know the, the the way I found the best way to compare prices at uh, Sam's Club and oh everything but the bagel. We just got that at Trader Joe's. Here it's six twenty three a pound, four forty nine for eleven and a half ounces. Ground cumin, pretty sure five seventy nine for fourteen ounces. That's cheaper when you buy your uh, stock up on seasonings at um, herbalcom.com. But when I was getting to, and I'm going to be done here, I promise. Um, oh, looky here, thirteen and a half pounds. Of Arm and Hammer baking soda for seven dollars. I just paid seven fifty, but didn't wasn't mine fifteen pounds? Maybe not. That might be a little cheaper here. Fifty cents cheaper. Hey, it's my fifty cents. Um, but anyway, I'm gonna wrap this up. The best way I have found to get your uh, price comparisons at Costco and Sam's Club is ultimately look online. You know, find something you use 
all the time or that you purchase at whatever club you belong to and look it up online and then look it up online at the other one they both allow you to have prices online even if you don't shop there so that's what I would do but then keep in mind that I have learned at Sam's Club some of the prices are actually cheaper in the store than they are online that's my personal experience from um, being a member and shopping at Sam's Club and then of course you have to go with what's local to your area we have this Costco my closest Costco is probably 15 miles away which is what the Sam's Club is as well but there's a lot more Sam's Clubs available to me than there are um, Costco's so that's probably why I would stick with the Sam's Club pound and a half of pine nights pine nuts for thirty dollars I don't know if that's bad or not spices more spices okay I did say I was done oh my gosh pecans ah oh, $5.99 a pound now I ran into this same thing at um, Sam's Club the other day they were over five dollars a pound and you've got to buy two pounds I can get a pound or less at Aldi for less per pound, only $5 a pound. So I won't get my pecans at Sam's Club nor at Costco. I'll continue to get my pecans at Aldi. So that's what it is. You have to not blindly shop in one particular spot. Although I do got to tell you for clothing and furniture. It really seems Costco has Sam's Club beat, especially in the store. Now, I know this is my last thing. I promise, I promise. <laughs> oh, saffron. Spanish saffron. Remember, I just showed this to you at, or at Trader Joe's, I think it was. And it was. it is the most expensive spice in the world. And here they break it down for you. So here's one gram. And that one gram is $10.79. How many pounds do you want at $4,904.55 per pound? Boom. We're done. Hey, what do you think of the difference of the prices? And um, be blessed, everyone.